Hi everyone! Excuse the lack of proper lighting right now. Um, usually I'd play around with it a little more. Now where I look kind of orange, but I'm not doing a specific look video right now. But I figured I'd just review a bunch of products, or not even a bunch, a group of products I just purchased a little while back that I'm absolutely in love with. Thought I'd let you know what's going on. Um, usually I wouldn't just make a video to review something just for the sake of it when it's especially when it's a group of products that's really so under overlooked it's really overlooked underrated but they're just really awesome and I figured these deserve their own video because this is pretty cool so basically anyone who knows me in real life knows that I'm obsessed with cupcakes and desserts and confectionaries and all that really awesome sweet stuff and I recently got a group of six lip lip balms I think it's what they're considered um, from Lip Smackers and this little package and they're all cupcake related and cupcakes are my obsessions not like I'm making them all the time but I just think they're so cute and oh I love cupcakes they're just so perfect so I got a group of six and I just kinda wanted to share them because they're really awesome I saw them on a beauty broadcast blog um, Emily Noel does them, I, does them I'm a huge 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 fan of hers and I saw it on her blog and I figured okay I gotta go get these but I couldn't find them and then when I did they finally started getting in the stores around my area now in the Chicago area they there were other things that I needed that I wanted that you know these weren't exactly on the top of my list they're more kind of right around here so I finally picked them up the other day and I'm so excited to share them because they're absolutely amazing um you know they look like this they're a little different than the traditional Lip Smackers um, packaging, but they're really, really awesome. I love them. Um, this one is Red Velvet. I mean, these are all generally true to smell. I don't want to say they're too obnoxiously flavored, but it's this really nice, like, fuchsia pinky color. and it's really pretty. Now, it definitely smells like Red Velvet, but I don't necessarily smell a lot of Red Velvet there's a lot of like vanilla in it. All these have a lot of vanilla scents in them. I feel like there's, I know there's a birthday cake candle that's sold at Kohl's and there's a birthday cake candle that is sold at, gosh, birthday cake candle that is sold at Yankee Candle that I absolutely love, both of them. And that's what all these smell like with little bits and pieces of other things added into it. Um, and then there's the birthday cake one, which is absolutely my favorite. I love anything birthday cake, excuse me, I love anything birthday cake flavored, especially like ice creams. Um, I really like that. I love like birthday cake, ice cream, batter, whatever, cupcakes. Those are my cupcakes, and I love those kind of ice creams, and I love the smell, and I just love how pretty they are, and I love the candles, and this, oh my gosh, it's dead on. It's so perfect. It's this... It's white based, but there's like, I don't know if you can see that, but there's like an iridescent, like, pinky tone to it. And it's really, really, really pretty. I love it. It's so shimmery. That's the one I've been wearing off and all I've been wearing today. Um, and then there's the vanilla coconut one. And it is a very, very pale yellow. It's almost lemony. And however, I am going to have to disagree with Emily on this one. She said on her blog that this wasn't coconut-y enough. And I think this is plenty coconut-y. I think there's almost a lemon taste um, a scent in it too. And that there's maybe not enough cake scent. But that's just me. And then I have the salted caramel one, which I was very, very, very excited for because I love salted caramel. It's one of my favorite things. I'll eat it straight up, but then when you can almost combine it with like a dessert, like a, like a cake, oh, it's, I absolutely love it. It's delicious. And this smells straight up like salted caramel. This is absolutely delicious. I love it. It's this orangey, browny type of color. It's really pretty. This one does have some color payoff. It's really, really not a lot. It's a very sheer color. That one, and I think the uh, red velvet one, the fuchsia one, was probably the only ones that were really too good with color payoff. And then it wasn't a lot. I mean, it's lip smackers. You're not getting a lot of color from that. And then there is the berry buttercream one. It's that light pinky purple. This one's really nice. 
I definitely smell like strawberry in this or definitely like strawberry. It does smell like berry buttercream. That's the best way to put it. If there's like a bowl of like berry buttercream frosting sitting in front of me, that's what it would be. It's delicious smelling. I love it. Then there's the last one, the strawberry sprinkle. I don't know, this one smells a lot like the berry buttercream, like a lot, a lot. Probably because they're both berry centered. This is strawberry and that's just berry nothing. I feel like this one has a little more of a cake scent to it and almost salty. There's like a slight salty smell to it. I don't know. It's really yummy. I like it. And it's like a light, very light pink. Now, and that's it. Again, I usually wouldn't go around and say, oh, you should go get this, you do that, or spend a review talking about lip balms in a case, but these are so yummy and they're so delicious and they're so cute and I love them and they're super duper moisturizing. I love lip smackers and everything they come out with and I wish I owned everything they can ever, ever came out with. They're so perfect and I love them and they're totally amazing. And that's all I have for you guys right now. Toodles!